tonight, we celebrate Hanukkah. Celebration goes back 2,160 years. My name is Rabbi Beryl Abertov, and together with my wife, Deborah Leah, we run the Santa Fe Jewish Center of Chabad. We have a beautiful new menorah. We're still going to be lighting it for the first time as the sun sets. I call on you, put all your energy into positivity. Hug your family, be kind to a stranger, do random acts of kindness. Hanukkah reminds us that we each have a candle within us. We have a soul that shines. And today's darkness, we all need more light. We have to remember to light your candle. It is a beautiful, beautiful day to start Hanukkah at sundown and to have a chance to celebrate the Festival of Lights and to be with friends. It's the best time of year. It is the miracle of the light that the rabbi said. I love that. The light that we each have within us that we are celebrating tonight. And so I'm very grateful that this will be my first official lighting of the menorah. Oh, wow. Yay! Yes, so many. Yes. I, want, I plan to come back over and over again. I love the fact that it's the Chile menorah, right? <laughs> so as a Nuevo Mexicana, as a Nuevo Mexicana whose ancestors fled the Inquisition, I say to all of you, Buen Hanukkah. <laughs> Thank you. Thank you so much, Representative Teresa Ledger Fernandez, Mayor Weber, to be here with you, and of course, Rabbi Levertov, uh, Rabbi Barrow, who's been a friend to all of us. He's a mentor, he's a teacher, he's there to lend a smile, he's there to lend a shoulder. It doesn't matter where we are in this beautiful state or across America or around the world, Rabbi Levertov is always there to lead by example. And let's just thank him one more time for what he does for us in keeping us safe and educated and fed with our souls, Rabbi. Just thank you so very much to be here to help continue this incredible tradition. Thousands of years ago, and the ties that we all have. As Representative Ledger Fernandez just reminded us, especially in beautiful places like New Mexico, families who have practiced so many faiths, I think it's always important to step back and reflect and to learn more about our families. I have a gift for each one of you. It's the power of the Hebrew alphabet by Gloria Bella Ballin. An artist, Gloria. local artist. Gloria. <laughs> Thank you, Gloria. The torch is passed. All right. Middle, middle, middle. All right. Will you try to eat it? Look at this. Look who's here. Chloe and Nancy, her friends, and my son. 
Well, we, we got to get five o'clock. Yeah, so we got to get that. Did you see the new menorah? Let's go. Shema Yisrael Adonai Eloheinu Adonai Yafad Baruch Shem Kevod Malchusa Le'olam Va'ed Uksharkam Le'od Al Yadacha Le'hayu Le'tot Le'tot Be'ne Necha it's so credible to see people. We've been locked down for so so long. Now we finally can come out. We hope we don't have to go back into lockdown. It was so amazing just to celebrate and connect to the community. And we hope and we pray to God that the miracles that he showed at Hanukkah should continue to showing miracles. We should have the miracles of the pandemic gone forever. Hanukkah is about transforming darkness into light. How a little bit of light could shine away a lot of darkness. Light overpowers might. That's the message of Hanukkah. So we all have a light within us, we have to shine it to the world around us. Happy Hanukkah.